this is literally the most spontaneous thing I've done in a long time. Well, hello there YouTube. Hello and welcome back to my channel. I have some very, very exciting news to share with you. I'm so excited. So let's get into it. As I announced last week, I am going to Costa Rica in the next few weeks. Now, why so randomly spontaneous, Hayley? Well, let me explain. Honestly, I'm so excited. It's been a destination that I've wanted to visit since I was in primary school, where I remember studying all about like the rainforest. And ever since then, it's been top, top, top of my bucket list. So let me talk you through <laughs> before I reveal what the exciting news is. Let me talk you through my itinerary so far. So the first week, so I'm going for three weeks in total. The first week is gonna be me just getting my grounding, getting over the jet lag, exploring a little bit as much as I can. Obviously I'll be documenting all of that. I'm in the midst of planning it at the moment. And then the next two weeks, oh, what do I want to tell you? <laughs> so you may be thinking, Hayley, why now? I had many other plans that I was supposed to be doing and this kind of came out of nowhere. It was something that I really didn't expect. Like I've always wanted to go, but sort of Central South America was not on the agenda just yet. What I'm about to tell you is quite spontaneous. It was one of those times where you sit there and you're like, oh my God, can I actually do this? So one of the videos that I want to go into um, in the future is how to create opportunities for yourself. So whether you know, you're feeling stuck at the moment, a bit lost, there's things you wanna do, you don't know how to sort of reach out. Um, I really wanna create a video around some of the things that I've done to really keep opening doors whenever I felt a bit stuck or a bit kind of needing fresh opportunities, just how I've kind of gone about that. And this is one of the ways. So I have joined a whole random bunch of Facebook groups. I found myself on a Facebook group for people who sail around the world and look to like join different boats and hop on up off and that kind of thing. And I saw a comment from a guy called Colin. Now, little did I know at the time, but Colin runs a rather successful and very, very cool YouTube channel called Parlay Revival. Check them out. I'm gonna link them below. You need to watch their YouTube videos. So I am going to be joining the Parlay Revival crew. So for two weeks, I'll be joining them on a hurricane damaged but rebuilt catamaran off the coast of Costa Rica. And I am so excited. Like, if you wanna see where I'm going, have a look at their channel. Um, it's unreal. The boat and everything looks so amazing. The crew look wicked as well. I'm so excited to meet everyone. Um, if you check out, I'll put them below the channel. You need to have a look at it. Like it's insane. What Colin has done with the boat, like just where they go, everything about it. If you want to see what I'm going to be up to and where I'm going to be, check it out. I'll put it in the description. It's unreal. I have not done that before. I have once sailed a boat and it was somewhere like south of England to the Isle of Wight and all I remember doing was like steering but like dodging these shipping containers. Also I realised I was doing a lot of this. What is with the hand gestures? <laughs> so in summary I will be heading out to Costa Rica for an entirety of three weeks. The first week I will be sort of just getting my ground, um, adjusting to the jet lag and exploring a little bit of Costa Rica um, as much as I possibly can in that time. Obviously gonna show you guys all the detail that goes into that. It'll be solo travel, so you'll get that kind of experience of it, the solo element, how I'm planning everything, what I get up to, how you can do it, um, and also how you can fit a lot into a week. I wanna try and not rush it, there's so much to see. A week is not enough to do this country justice. I'm just gonna try and get as much of a taster of Costa Rica as I can in that short amount of time. Um, obviously this channel, Wild Ever Since, it's all about wildlife, nature, adventure, like getting off the beaten track a bit. So I'm gonna try and search out some places that have the most wildlife that we can spot, 
some of the hot spots as well one place that has always 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 been on my list is Monteverde I think I'm pronouncing it right forgive me if I'm not um, but I've always wanted to head there and explore the cloud forest um, so I'll be doing that for sure the last two weeks I'll be hopping on board Parley Revival joining Colin and the crew and sailing for two weeks and obviously we'll be documenting that as well so like I said check out Parley Revival below to get a really good idea of what I'll be getting up to I'm so excited and we will be continuing the planning the journey is going to be a proper series the next one being all around the planning of the trip so we'll look at flights route accommodation all the things that you need to prep before you head off this is specific to Costa Rica but also it can apply to any trip if you're thinking about solo travel backpacking heading to Costa Rica even just traveling anywhere to be honest this information will be useful for you one of the things I'm most excited about is to get on the boat and meet the crew with the mindset of like getting out and enjoying life and enjoying every moment and taking risks and just making the absolute most um, so I'm really excited to be around people with that kind of similar mindset and just yeah experience that lifestyle that is just so incredibly rare and I feel so lucky to even be going um, so yeah it's gonna be amazing thank you so much for watching this video guys I am so excited to have shared it all with you um, do hit the subscribe button and the little notification bell if you've enjoyed it because then you'll be notified of the next videos and I'm so glad to bring you guys along with me for the journey and yeah let's go on a bloody adventure <laughs>